What is going on, y'all? Robert Sykes, KetoSavage.com, and I got a special little unboxing video for you today. So, if you're listening to this channel, if you're watching me on YouTube, you're probably eating a lot of meats because you're following a ketogenic or carnivore diet. Meat is the powerhouse of all nutrition. So, what better to cook your meat with than a badass grill? I happen to have one right here. This is from Schwank. I think I say that right. Schwank Grills. And they reached out to me and they said, hey, yo, Rob, let's hook you up with a grill for a couple Instagram posts. And I'm like, heck yeah, sign me up. So I've heard about these. I'm actually in the market for a grill anyways because my Traeger's kind of been going on the wayside. Not to talk shit about Traeger, but they just like, I've been unimpressed with my Traeger as of late. We did the grill giveaway for uh, the keto brick giveaway and we did a Yoder smoker which is a super awesome smoker I want to get one of those too um, but this one I've been also been wanting to get because there's like multiple different ways to cook a steak and other food for that matter this one's got some pretty unique properties let's dive into it let's we'll start with an unboxing though so you got all this fancy packaging material in here we'll just go all out with it all right, this thing looks sexy, y'all. I'm excited to show y'all this. All right, this thing is solid, y'all. It's got stainless steel, cool little bull emblem here, which I'm digging. Everything's wrapped up, looking good. Package weighs 71 pounds. Make sure you lift with your legs, all that good stuff. But you've got, I'm not really good at reading directions, so I need to probably do that. But we'll just open this up and see what we're working with here. Replacement grill propane uh, protective grill cover are included. So this is propane. You've got your propane hose here. So I'm about to get a propane tank for that. I've got the grill cover. Got a user manual. I'll definitely need to be reading that bad boy. Um, and then we have the grates, which I believe are the grates here. So, oh, that's my knife. Let's see what we got cooking here. Little handle thing. Now, again, yeah, I should probably read the directions before I do this. So I might just do that. But. Before I dive into the directions, let me give you a little overview of what I know. I'm going to get this thing actually all set up, cook a steak on it, show you all the whole process, but I want to do an unboxing so you can see what it looks like upon delivery. But the cool thing about this grill is that it cooks at 1500 degrees. So you crank up your propane tank, you turn the grill on, and then you're searing your steak at 1500 degrees. So you, depending on how you like your steak, you pretty much put it on this tray, lift it up to the heating element, and cook it for like one minute, one minute, minute and a half per side. Lower it back down, flip it, repeat on the next side. So I love the you know pellet smokers and traditional smokers for that smoky flavor that you get when you're cooking something for hours on end. But I also really love a nice crust that comes when you sear something at incredibly hot temperature for a very short period of time, which is where this beauty is going to truly excel. So. We all know I'm in a competition prep right now. I'm not eating steaks, so I'm going to be cooking some of these for Crystal so she can sample it for y'all and tell you what it tastes like. I'm going to cook it for y'all so you can see how that's done. But then once my prep is over, you can rest assured I'm going to be eating steaks off of this beauty day in and day out. So that's pretty much the unboxing. Again, this is Schwank Grills. Uh, it's fun to say, Schwank. Um, so check them out for sure. I'll put a link in the description, all that good stuff, and then we'll see you at the house for the setup and use of this beast. All right, y'all, so we're here in the kitchen and we got Crystal behind the camera, not Chip, so it may not be quite as cinematic, but I got faith in Crystal. Love you, babe. All right, so we have our ribeye steaks, and what'd you get, a strip steak? That's what it looks like, New York strip steak. Yeah. Um, and we're gonna fire up the Schwank grill and put them on there. I've only put salt on these because since this grill cooks at such a high temperature, you don't want to put a bunch of peppercorns on there or anything like that because that's going to burn the peppercorns. So I've just put salt on there. They've come to room temp. Salt's on there. It's going to make all that flavor more pronounced. I got thermometers in here because I want to see how this grill cooks from an internal heating standpoint. So let's fire up the grill and show you how it's done. 
All right, so I'm gonna try and fit three stakes on here. We'll see how that goes. All right, now put it back in and go to the very top setting, which is 1500 degrees. And sit it there for one minute. All right, one minute. I'm gonna drop them down, pull it out, flip them over. And then repeat on that side. I'm gonna put some popped mushrooms in here, stuffed mushrooms in here just to kind of get some, some hors d'oeuvres going. Soaking up some of those meat juices. Now it's been there for a minute. I'm gonna drop it down to three. And let it cook there until it's done. All right, so the steaks are done. Look at that. So I'm gonna put these on the grate to soak up some of those juices and rest a little bit. And while those are resting, I'm gonna go ahead and put my mushrooms a little bit higher on the temperature here to finish those bad boys out. Smelling marvelous. I overcooked them just a tad. Yeah, I left them on a too high of a setting, but they're still going to be marvelous. Next time, I'll just finish them off a little bit lower on the setting than what I had it on. But they super quick and easy to cook. I am freaking stoked about this grill thank you so very much swank i'm genuinely super excited about this because i'm going to be eating a ton of steaks looking marvelous oh my truth crystal likes hers a little bit more medium so this might be actually perfect this is perfect <coughs> see pretty good it's actually pretty good mm -hmm. very juicy all right, y'all dive in.